Alright, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video on this channel. The thing is show you guys how to get a translucent uh, taskbar for free on Windows 10. This is a really random video. This kind of just uh, came to my head randomly. I was just sitting here and I just thought I should record it. Now, this is what it normally looks like um, without one. It's just black um, and it's pretty plain. It doesn't look too special. And I'm going to show you guys how to do this in two minutes. So if this does help you, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, let's just get right into the video. So, first thing you want to do is go into Microsoft Store, and you're just gonna open that up, and you're gonna go to the search bar and search up translucent. Um, okay, just stop searching translucent TV. Here it is, right here. I already have it installed, but this is free, so you can just download it, and it takes like two seconds. Pretty sure it's really small. As you can see, I already have it. It says launch, and you guys, it should say get if you don't have it. And I'm just gonna launch it up. Not sure how long it's going to take. Pretty sure it's already open. Yeah, it's already open. So literally just open it up. And as you can see, my translucent taskbar is open. It takes about like two seconds to do. So if you go in like a Google tab or something, you can see through it. It's just blurry. And I'm going to show you guys how to open it like um, like as your PC opens. So you're just going to go into Task Manager. Just right click your taskbar. And then you're going to go to Startup. And then as soon as all this stuff will uh, load in like that. You're just going to go to Translucent Taskbar, right click on it, and click Enable. I have it disabled because I don't really use it, but just click uh, Enable if you want it to enable and start up. It's pretty straightforward. That's pretty much how you do it. And if you want to close it, just click this little up arrow and right click, press click Exit. And I'm pretty sure you can do like some settings with it and stuff like that too. So if you guys want to mess around with that, then make sure to do that. But yeah, that's pretty much the entire video. It's a really short one. Hope you guys enjoy. And we will see you in the next one. Peace out.